Good morning. Um, it is very early in the morning, Monday morning, and I wanted to see how your guys' social media fast went yesterday, if you did it with me. Um, but I wanted to talk really quick about my spiritual dreams. Um, well, I want to talk about one of them. And also real quick, some of you ladies out there were like, Beth, what do you mean? We still need to be informed. Like, we can take a break, but, you know, we need to know what's going on in the world. Okay, remember, that's not what the dreams were about. I agree with you. Yes, we need to be informed. We need to know what's going on. Remember, in the dream, um, we were putting our screen time and our social media before our family and before our scripture reading, our, our personal relationship with God. That's what the dream was about. It wasn't about how you should just get off there and not get on there anymore and, and not be informed. Okay, so that's not at all. I mean, I agree with you ladies totally. Um we just want to make sure we're making our family and our Heavenly Father a priority. That's it. That's all. Um, and I want to thank you, Marco, for sending me that thing about Jezebel. He sent me this thing on um, how she destroys nations and how that could also represent the woman, right, in that second dream. Um, so yesterday, my social media fast went great. I didn't get on any social media, and it was awesome. And um, so my goal now is to just get on there twice a week because I do some videos and I have a group on Facebook that I that I do some fun things with. So Sunday and Thursday are my two days that I'm going to be that I'll allow myself to get on uh, Facebook and Instagram. The other ones, Parlor's gone. Me, we I don't really get on there. And I don't remember the other ones. But so that's my goal. That's what I'm doing. I'm doing twice a week. And I think that's that's going to be healthy for me. Um, and then YouTube, I'm going to I'm still figuring that one out because, you know, Kirsten, I love your channel. Um, and Marco, and there's other channels out there that I watch, Troy, and some other ones. Um, so I probably will just make sure that I'm not on it when my kids are home. And, and um, you know, I like to listen to Kirsten on in the mornings when I'm making breakfast. So that kind of thing. Okay. All right. So real quick about these dreams. Two things. Um, number one, I didn't mention the tigers. More on the tigers. And so um, the interpretation that I got was that, you know, typically tigers and wild animals you wouldn't get close to. Right. And in the dream... Um, in this attraction, we were interacting with them and petting them and taking pictures with them, right? So think about what kind of dangers do you have on your screens that you normally publicly would not interact with, that you wouldn't have, you wouldn't want people to know that you're interacting with. Um, and that could fall under, you know, like maybe pornography. I do not have a problem with pornography, but I know other people do. Or maybe how you're interacting with people. You know, what are you doing behind closed doors? You know, things like that, okay? In the comment section and things like that. Or Facebook Messenger, right? And then the other thing that was really important to me that I did not mention was, remember when I was walking along that path and I ended up choosing um, to not go back into the darkness to get my phone? I chose to go with my family. In the dream, more people were headed into the darkness, into that screen time then they were moving on with their family. So those were the things that I wanted to mention. All right, guys. Um, yes, stay informed, but just put God and family first. Okay. All right, you guys have a great week. Set up some boundaries, set up some goals, pray. And I know that God will help you. And I will see you guys Sunday morning.